it's so nice here. So why am I here for Panchkarma? Well, mostly because of two aspects. One is that I like to my quest for help. And the second more important reason is my insatiable uh, curiosity. So I've pretty much tried all healing modalities. I've tried Reiki, homeopathy, Ayurveda, naturopathy, Cairo, osteopathy, yoga, uh, Western medicine, um, acupuncture, mantra. And it's my conclusion that everything works. And some systems work more and some systems work less, but everything works. And so why is this? Like, why does everything work? I think that the main reason for this is that everything that is inside us and outside us, there is a healthy medium ground where if you stay there, it's a healthy zone. Too much or too little can either heal you or hurt you. For example, sound. We're made of sound, light, emotions, thoughts, touch, chemicals, food, liquids, thoughts. So all of these things can hurt you or harm you. So that's why everything works. Reiki works, mantra works, homopathy works, Western medicine works. Ayurveda works, everything works. But some systems work more. And I found out of all these systems, I liked Ayurveda the most. And the reason being that Ayurveda believes in a healthy middle ground. If you go over excessively or if you're deficient and go under, you are entering the disease zone. So they know where health is. In other systems, Western medicine, they cannot tell you what is healthy. They can tell you what is sick, but they don't know what is healthy. For instance, are your bones healthy if there is no disease? But Ayurveda will tell you whether your bones are becoming unhealthy even before the disease manifests by certain parameters. So in the coming videos, I am going to talk about more of Ayurveda and its concepts. And I just want to give an example, like for example, sugar. We all need sugar. But if you have too much sugar or too little sugar, your you're affected. You can swing between hyper and hypoglycemia and it makes your body dysfunctional. You get either hyper or fatigue, dizziness, and yet there is a medium where you can function healthy, in a healthy, happy manner. So it is this middle ground that Ayurveda has always known about even the Indian sciences, ancient sciences. So maybe that's why they're more effective in pinpointing when you're deviating from the healthy zone. And that's why it's caught my interest. And in the future videos, I will be talking about various things that I have learned about Ayurveda. Until then, goodbye from Bali.